Hi, uh, I just want to uh, set the record straight how to assign different uh, classes to individual modules in Joomla. It's really easy and some people have problems with that so I want to clarify with I want to clarify how to explain how to, in details how to do this. It's really simple. For example, uh, here are like different modules. This module if uh, has a class uh, gold assigned to it, so it it's in the nice blue uh, square. It has a little bit of padding and stuff like this. This top module, it's called the context form from uh, the site uh, from another website that I downloaded from. Uh, it's uh, it has another uh, class assigned it to it. So let's check uh, this login form. How to assign uh, custom class to this uh, module? Uh, let's uh, go to the admin and uh, let's open that module that you want the custom uh, class to uh, assign to. It's called uh, login. It's a simple login, you login um, module. And here where you have uh, module class suffix you just add dash and the name of the class I named it gold I don't know why but uh, I wanted to make something gold and, and I switched the colors to blue so uh, at the end I should name it blue or something but let's go to the FTP and let's check the template CSS how to how to do this how to set the custom uh, module CSS Let's make this window a little bit smaller and just find the gold. And here it is. It's here is the class. Uh, it's a dot module table and dash gold. And then you have like a simple uh, uh, CSS parameters. For example, I set the border to solid one and this blue color. I add some padding and margin at the bottom and set the position to relative. I also added background, but now I disabled because I didn't want any background uh, anymore. Uh, you can set up a different styles, different. Uh, you can have like module table dash gold dash blue dash. Uh, sunshine dash rain whatever you want and you have to name the dot module table dot uh, dash and the name of the CS the name of the class you want uh, the name of the class and then you go uh, you save you upload you save the template CSS uh, the main CSS template where you have all the CSS uh, classes and IDs and uh, then you just go to uh, extensions and modules and just assign the class assign the model class suffix dash gold and press save and this how it's done for example let's remove this I click apply and let's check how it looks without the gold class let's refresh the page you see it doesn't have the blue border no padding and stuff so let's go back to the admin and set it to gold save and refresh again refresh one more time I think I have to clear the cache you know because gold ok 
Okay, everything is okay. I have to clear the cache. Clean cache. Delete. Let's check it again. Refresh the page. Okay, you see it's in the blue, blue, blue square. Uh, you have like a nice blue border that you set up in uh, CSS. It's so simple. You can assign each module to custom CSS, so you, each module can look uh, differently. You know, it can have different colors, different backgrounds. There are there are endless possibilities to do this.